After years of reading articles, news stories, and the housing marketing forecasts, there are three top features that consistently stand out as affecting decisions of home buyers across the generations when buying their first or existing home. All three tend to be non-negotiable to the majority of buyers. So let's take a look at what these three are. Number one, curb appeal. Sellers only get one chance to make a first impression with any potential buyer, and that's when they drive up. That's how important curb appeal is. You can never take a new first impression. Buyers should be so impressed, so intrigued and excited that they can't wait to get out of the car and look inside. Number two, space. The number one reason why people buy homes is to have more room. They're either moving from a rental, usually an apartment, or up to their forever home for more space for their family and to do the things that they love to do. Number three, updates. First time buyers and singles tend to buy older homes because they're more affordable than buying a new one. Sellers should at least consider replacing the most dated features like countertops, cabinet poles, or appliances. In many cases, it's not that tough and it can make a huge impact. And then also, just invest in new towels, bath mats, and a shower curtain in the bathroom. It looks brand new, it smells good. Homeowners don't expect a mansion, nor do they expect a pre-owned home in new condition, but they do expect to see pride of ownership and you want them to see themselves in your house and live in the dream. I hope this short list of the top features gives some insight into what buyers value most. In some areas, we're experiencing the fastest market in 50 years, but if the home doesn't meet the expectations, as you know, it can sit on the market for way too long, and as it does, value goes down. Now for minding your own business. Today I want to talk about one of the ways strategic thinking and marketing really works, partnering with allies, one of the great assets. We do a lot of co-branding and tri-branding because marketing partnerships have a number of benefits. So, number one, when you collaborate with someone else, you tend to deliver better content than you would by yourself. Number two, marketing partnerships are cheaper to create. Number three, you're gonna see success a lot more quickly. And number four, you get to expose your brand to a new audience. For example, prior to being acquired by eBay, Half.com worked the town of Halfway, Oregon to change its name to Half.com in exchange for stock, internet access, and other giveaways. So, who do you partner with? We've partnered with several local retailers, one which pulled their coupon because they had too many redeemed. What a great problem, right? We also co-brand collateral with agents, insurance companies, and other real estate affiliated businesses. It's a great opportunity that works, so definitely give it a try. Well, that's this week's edition of the Real Estate Insider Weekly. Thank you for joining me again. Have a great day. Talk to you soon.